what's going on guys always winner and today we are coming out with a video now friday and saturday i did not stream i am sorry for that and if you guys didn't know i stream i stream or i try to stream every single weekday and on the weekends it's either videos or i stream or nothing will happen on the channel on the weekends but on the weekdays i tend to stream so i'm sorry guys i didn't stream i'll be streaming tomorrow i got no school tomorrow so i'll be streaming for a while tomorrow i'm gonna be streaming some rules of survival so if you guys want to go ahead and tune in you guys feel free to do so now today guys is actually going to be a video on how to live stream your guys self so if you guys want to go ahead and start up a youtube channel and you guys will just want to play your games while you know having a uh, fan base kind of thing and you know talking to other people while you're playing your game and stuff this is what i'm going to teach you guys how to do today and this is how i do my live streams myself as well so before we get into the video guys i just want to let you guys know that i stream every day and i'm also doing a giveaway a 15 dollars itunes giveaway now if you guys want to join that and tune in and also you guys want to go ahead and take part in the giveaway there'll be a link to the video that i did and that describes all the rules and everything you need to know about the giveaway that link will be in the description below but today guys let's go ahead and jump on into it so the first thing you're going to need to do is you're going to need to open up firefox chrome you know safari whatever you guys have and you guys just need to type in the search bar obs now once you search that up you're going to get this window with all these different sites you're going to go ahead and type in open broadcast software home and you're going to be brought to this page now you got windows mac and you got linux now mac i had this on my macbook before i got my gaming pc and now i have it on windows because that's what gaming pc runs is windows so i got it on windows so you're going to go ahead download whatever whatever you're on if you're on mac you're going to click this one if you're on linux i have actually no idea what linux is you're going to go ahead and click that one but i'm on windows so windows people click windows now once you do that it's going to go through this whole process about downloading installing terms of service and all that but once you read your way through that you're going to be brought to a screen that looks like this now i'm going to go ahead and add a machine you're going to be brought to a screen that looks like this now on this side you're going to see my the right side is your live feed and the left side is what you can add into your live feed so people can't see this side but people can see what's on this side now here's something it might, it's gonna look a little confusing guys but trust me it's really not that confusing i thought it was confusing but i overstressed everything and it's actually very very easy so right here if you guys want to go ahead and let's say you guys want to stream um rules of survival like i do you're gonna go ahead and come down here and you're gonna add a new scene now i'm gonna compare this it's gonna be a horrible analogy but just stick with me so your scenes are like a cup okay like a cup c-u-p a cup that holds liquid okay that's what a scene basically is you can title this scene whatever you want as you can see i got my rules recording when i'm doing videos you have i have my scene two and c3 but that's just for this video so basically you title this whatever you want so let's say i want to title this r OS for World of Survival. I'm gonna go ahead and hit OK. Now that's our cup. Now sources is what the water is. So sources is water. So the cup is gonna be holding the water, just like cups do, right? So the sources is all the good stuff inside of the cup, whatever you guys drink, whatever it is. Now you're gonna go ahead and add a new source. Now this source could be anything you want. You got browser source, color source, display capture. Um, so currently if you guys want to stream a game we're going to go ahead and click on game capture now you can name whatever you guys want this doesn't really you know i don't really care about this part just hit ok and now you get this window you're going to go ahead and hit capture any specific window and you're going to open up your game like i did here my game is open you're going to go ahead open up that game come back into obs and you're going to type in or you're not going to type anything you're going to click this window section right here click on that and hit whatever window you want to start recording or streaming you go ahead click on that window and there you go that window now pops up now you can have your capture cursor or you can turn that off so it can't so like now you can't when i'm playing the game you can't see my cursor but if i want it on you can keep it on and you got all these other settings right here once you're done with that just hit ok and basically that's all you have to do now what you guys want to do is you want to come over here to the what you know the left side if you guys want to use studio or not 
I'm just using studio for the you know sake of this video you're gonna go ahead and drag this window down to minimize it and then you're gonna put it in we're basically essentially what we're doing is resizing the window now you got some shortcuts here control shift is gonna be able to kind of make your window bigger without stretching it or shrinking it or whatever making it look weird and also you have a tool here which if you hold down alt and you come to the corner any corner you can actually drag and you can cut parts of your window out but obviously we don't want to do that so now that you have this centered and you're capturing the full entire game and everything that you want to capture you guys need to go ahead and open up firefox and you guys need to go to your youtube dashboard now this is going to be this is going to be strictly for streaming you have to do this so if you guys don't want to be streaming go ahead and skip some of this part of the video because this part you need to do to be able to live stream your game that you're playing now once you go here you click on live streaming and that's going to bring you to a whole nother screen if you will now it says welcome back always win that's just because i stream now i have my thumbnail i also have my title i have my description with all my stuff in it and you know my category gaming and i have the name of the game down below and then you obviously have your live chat feed going on right here during your live streams you can read chat and this is live so there is a delay in the stream you cannot fix that it's just you know because you're trying to live stream it's not going to get it at the exact moment because what a live stream is is basically recording and trying to put that recording out as fast as possible it's a confusing thing but it's going to be a delay but your chat is not ever delayed so the main part we're on and the main reason we're on this live streaming tab is because you need to come down here to your stream name slash key now you guys do not want to show this to anybody because let's say you know somebody showed me this let's say for the sake of it pewdiepie showed his stream name and key out i can go ahead and i can copy that key or type the key in in obs and i can start streaming on pewdiepie's channel so you guys want to make sure you do not give this out to anybody so what you're going to do you're going to hit reveal then you're going to copy it and then hit hide there will be an option that says hide then you're going to hide it so nobody else could see it and you will never be able to see it again unless you hit reveal and it also is very important if you change your stream key then you have to change it in obs so once you guys have that copied we're going to head back into obs and this is where the this is how you're going to be able to stream so now you just got your game and everything but this is how you're going to be able to stream onto your youtube platform so you're going to go into settings here down at the bottom right and here's where all this kind of crazy stuff happens now theme you know you have your default you have i don't even know how to pronounce that and then you have your dark theme i like on dark dark theme because it just you know helps with my eyes it's not so bright and everything especially if you're trying to do a night stream or something you open obs and it's not just a white screen shining in your eyeballs so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to head to stream and you're going to see these options so you just keep everything the same and you want to select your service whether you're streaming on youtube twitch smashcast mixer all these different things you want to go ahead and if you're going to stream on youtube click on youtube if you're going to stream on twitch click on twitch it is i think so far the exact same for every kind of service now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go ahead and copy and paste your stream key or you're going to want to paste your stream key that you copied from your youtube dashboard and your live stream you're going to want to go ahead and paste that into here and then you're going to want to hit apply so once you hit apply everything's saved you never have to come in here and change it and then you got all these other options where it says you know output audio video all that kind of stuff which is I mean it's not really important you can change all that stuff if you want it's pretty much self-explanatory I mean mic slash auxiliary audio device of course you're gonna have your microphone headphones all that kind of stuff so once you're done putting in your stream key go ahead apply and then hit ok and here is where the fun happens guys so if you guys have a mic plugged in your mic will show down here you can see how mine is if you guys have music or something in the background it'll show up here as desktop audio or even in game sound it will show up as desktop audio so now what you want to do because everything is set up go ahead and lock this game capture because what that's going to do is allow you if you actually miss click or something you can't drag or click on this window to change your screen now if you unlock it see i can click on it and i can do stuff that i want with it so let me go ahead and fix this real quick so make sure it's locked if you guys do not want to change anything in your obs window or whatever and of course you can unlock it at any time you want 
Also, if you guys want to show a different kind of window, you can just obviously hit the eyeball and that turns it off. And then once you hit it, it comes back on. So now that everything is set up, you can go ahead and come back into your YouTube live streaming. And basically, every time you're going to live stream, you're going to open up YouTube. You're going to click on your profile, hit Creator Studio, and that's going to bring you to your dashboard. Then you're going to hit live streaming. And once you go to your live stream, here's what happens. Once you go ahead and do this, you have a thumbnail, you hit change thumbnail if you want to change your thumbnail and you just select the thumbnail you want to put as your thumbnail. This is going to be like when you see a video, the thumbnail, the picture you see before you click on the video. This is what people are going to see before they click on your live stream. So, you know, you want something catchy and flashy so people will click on your live stream and tune in and watch you. So, now that you've got all this, you're going to want to select a title, make a make up a title. You're going to want to go ahead and have a you know have a description telling your fans you know help me out subscribe if you guys want to follow my social media here you go if you guys want to support the stream go ahead donate to my link right here and also I have my giveaway link right there just in case people tuning in the live stream want to go ahead and join my giveaway then click that link it'll take them to that video I posted of the giveaway so basically now that we got this it is very nice to have a second monitor or a second device to where you can just watch your live stream yourself so you can read chat while you're playing your game now once you start streaming you're gonna come into your game and this is basically all you're gonna see yourself you're just gonna see you playing the game you're not gonna see anything else and obviously if you want to you can go ahead click OBS and that'll show your stream if you have it set up like this it'll show your stream everything you guys are seeing right now but if you guys don't want your stream to see all that it's best to have a second monitor and stuff so therefore you can watch your stream and stuff and see if you're doing it okay and also you don't want your stream to be looking at this because that's not entertaining you just want them to see the gameplay so obviously a second monitor is going to help because you can put OBS on a second monitor and your stream will be able to see that they'll only see your gameplay so that does help as well now once you have a game you could do whatever you want on the game and your stream is only going to see what you do on the game and that's basically it that's that's pretty much the plain Jane simple everything that's that's basically the easiest steps to go ahead and stream on now my bad I'm gonna go ahead and go over streaming so as you can see I'm recording right now but if I wanted to start streaming because your stream key is in to OBS it's gonna be saved automatically because stream key is saved into there it obviously knows what your channel is where your channel is and once you hit start streaming whatever is on your screen it's gonna start streaming that to your YouTube channel and people will be able to come see whatever is on your screen so make sure you guys are on your game or hit start streaming and hit your game so you're just streaming your game or whatever you guys want to do but once you guys want to stop streaming you literally come back to OBS and you click stop streaming and that ends your stream that's it nobody can see whatever else you're doing after your stream that's it and if you want to hit record you obviously hit record and then you hit stop recording if you guys want to stop recording and that's basically the gist of how to go ahead and stream on OBS guys that is very simple and I hope this helps you guys I mean it's a very simple thing if you guys want to learn how to you know go ahead and put your sub count down below and make maybe make a um, you know kind of like a donation goal or a subscriber goal up top be sure to let me know down below I can and will go over that if you guys want to see that it's very simple but I can go ahead and make a video on how to show you guys how to put your live sub count and stuff in your screen so your stream can see and everything like that also if you guys want to see how to set up um, donations like when somebody donates it pops up on their screen or when somebody follows you or subscribes to you it'll show up on the stream saying that they subscribe to you or donate to you I can also go over that as well so be sure to leave a like on the video guys and thank you guys so much for tuning in. I hope this video helped you guys. I know it's kind of a short video. It's just kind of a rush video. But I hope this did help some of you guys into start streaming. It's very fun to stream, guys. It's awesome to have a community where you can talk to people and they talk back. Basically, back and forth. It's just very fun to live stream, to be honest. It's very fun. I enjoy it. And if you guys have any questions, let me know down below. Thank you guys so much for the support. Don't forget to join in on my giveaway. And I will see you guys in the video tomorrow. Actually, I'll be live streaming tomorrow. I'll see you guys in the live stream tomorrow. Thank you guys. Make sure to hit that sub button and also that like button. And peace out. In a mansion, diamonds on me and they dancing. I don't really understand rappers. Niggas jumping on bandwagons. All these bands got my pants sagging. Six 
threes on the bands white. Six twos on the mad back. Bitch, we coming for the payback. Six twos in the pot, nigga, try to whip it up and bring it way back. Woo! You in the club and you spending your car money.